Snapdragon about uh, 135 meters away from the space station right now. Beautiful view from the station as uh, both of the spacecraft pass uh, 253 statute miles over the western uh, border of Sedan right now. Again, uh, SpaceX uh, Dragon uh, packed with three tons of uh, science research supplies and hardware uh, to be delivered to the station today. Just about two more minutes until it gets to about 100 meters away from the International Space Station. Again, SpaceX packed with about three tons of uh, scientific experiments and other supplies. Some of the experiments aboard include uh, seedling growth number three. Monitor one is one and a half port and half a vehicle link length uh, forward. And on monitor three, we're about half a vehicle length uh, starboard and lined up. Uh, you can see that the SpaceX cargo vehicle is just a little bit misaligned from that um, uh, the crosshairs there. Uh, she's just reporting that that's a, just a little bit off, a couple meters. Uh, everything reporting nominal here, though, in uh, Mission Control Houston. SpaceX about to uh, get about now 102 meters away from this space station. Now uh, the space station and the Dragon cargo vehicle on the eastern border of Egypt now passing right over the Red Sea. Cygnus now at 62 meters uh, away from the International Space Station, approaching that 30 meter holding point. Again, that is scheduled to happen uh, after an orbital sunset. Uh, that should happen around 8.06 or 8.07 a.m. Central Time today. Right here is the view that uh, our two astronauts aboard the International Space Station now in the cupola uh, at the controls of the robotic arm. This is the view they have uh, of the Dragon cargo vehicle as it approaches the International Space Station.
this view here again from the cupola workstation, uh, that bay window uh, that's on the nadir side or the earth facing side of node 3 tranquility. The International Space Station and the Dragon spacecraft uh, now crossing over the northern border of China into an orbital sunset. Seeing an orbital sunrise there at the bottom left of your screen, uh, right when the lighting conditions are sufficient, uh, we'll be doing a go, no go for capture. They're actually starting to go around the room right now uh, to use that station's robotic arm to uh, capture the SpaceX vehicle. Now seeing an orbital sunrise, the station and the dragon, uh, 260 statute miles over the South Pacific Ocean, uh, going into an orbital sunrise approaching the west co western coast of Chile. Once lighting conditions are sufficient, uh, flight control teams here will give the crew the go, again Peggy Whitson and uh, Jack Fisher, the go for capture. They'll start using the station's robotic arm uh, to capture the dragon spacecraft. Two meters from capture. One meter to capture. Reporting a good alignment so far. Over the pin. Capture in progress.
still holding, awaiting for the snares to close. And Houston Station on 2, capture complete. Go for post-capture configura reconfiguration.